When we hear about 40 coming up on test, we automatically assume 40 out of 100, meaning that you failed. Now that's not necessarily the case. The reason I'm bringing this up is because I was watching a lecture on a professor who was appalled that the students didn't know the difference between 40th percentile and 40%. Now, that's not fair, because guess what? In high school, we're always conditioned to just have a standard test score out of 100. If you got 40, you failed the test, right? And all of a sudden, in college, if you haven't taken statistics or anything, you miraculously need to know. Mean, standard deviation, bell curve, what each and every one of those means. That's not fair, right? So let's talk about the difference. 40th percentile and 40%. Now, 40th percentile means out of the entire population that took the exam, you did better than 40% of them. It doesn't necessarily mean you had a specific test score in relation to the test. It's just that your placement in relation to the entire population, you did better than 40%. Now, 40% in the test means that out of 100, you got 40% of them correct. So that's the big difference.